But now I have a question for you. If Go you, ahead. If you guys uh, remember last video, you would be able to determine at which altitude were we at that time. Correct? So look, we've got, we said an ISA of minus one and we have a temperature of minus 51 degrees. Correct? So at which altitude are we? So simply, ISA minus one at sea level, we are not at 15, but rather at 14. So we do 14 plus 51. 51. How much is 14 plus 51? Look at it, 65. 65. Okay, so 65 times 1,000, it's also possible, like this is the same thing, makes it 65,000, correct? Correct. Now, 65,000 divided by 2? 325. 325. So 32,500 feet. Guess what, guys? We were flying at 32,500 feet coming back from Sydney to Doha. Is it possible to fly at such altitude if you're on an IFR flight? Well, if we're doing it, it means it is. <laughs> <laughs> of course, many people ask about it and uh, they always ask, how come you're flying an ode when it should be an even flight level or, or the opposite or even flying 325, which is a, for them a VFR because it's a plus 500, which is a VFR reference, right? Um, well, the first thing is we are authorized to do it by the HSC controller because we ask for a block level. So we follow our optimum and our optimum is the best fuel consumption, the best speed, the best timing. And we try to follow our, our optimum throughout the flight. And throughout the flight, we lose weight because we are, we are consuming our fuel. fuel, correct? So our optimum increases. increases. So we try to follow it in order to consume less fuel, go faster, etc. There are many, many parameters, by the way, to this. And uh, we ask, for example, here we asked the controller to fly, to fly between 320 and 340, any level we want. And we chased our optimum, which was 325. But if it is, let's say, 327, I can fly 327. 330, although we are flying west, west because we're coming back from Sydney, uh, approximately, let's say, northwest. We are flying between 270, heading 270 west or, and uh, north, uh, 360. And you know, guys, between uh, 180 and 359, we fly even number. Even number. And the opposite, we fly odd, odd numbers between uh, 360, 000, and 179 degrees. So, of course, we're authorized. Many people ask, you know what? Many pilots ask me. Really? Yeah, pilots flying in Europe because they don't fly oceanic. They don't, they don't fly over the sea for. Coming back from Sydney, we fly almost. 12 hours over the sea. No, no, less, no, sorry. We fly, let's say, 10 hours over the sea. That's incredible. So, yeah, it's, it's incredible. We are just, we are just connected uh, through CPDLC and we communicate uh, this way. Wonderful. This is it.